Hi, I'm Jake, and today we have an all Paris version of Auto Week TV. The debuts are going on as we speak, so here's a quick rundown of what we've seen already. And remember, we have more pictures and information at AutoWeek.com. Mercedes kicked off the show with an electric SLS AMG. The half million dollar supercar uses a high tech driveline with four electric motors, one at each corner. The total output is a whopping 740 horsepower and 738 pound feet of torque. That's more than the standard SLS. The Jaguar F-Type has finally been revealed. After months of speculation, we now know that the baby Jag will offer three engines, two supercharged V6s, making 335 and 375 horsepower, and a supercharged V8, making 488 horsepower. And that's in a body smaller than the current XK. Lamborghini updated the Gallardo line. It gets new front and rear end treatments with more angles and some functional vents. The company also introduced the Edizione Technica package, which adds carbon ceramic brakes, a high fixed rear wing, and optional exclusive coloring. We'll wrap up today with Bentley going racing. The company hasn't fielded a race team since 2003 when it won the 24 Hours of Le Mans. Bentley unveiled the rear wheel drive Continental GT3, which will return to the racetrack in late 2013. The Continental GT3 will work with a twin turbo W12 engine making 616 horsepower and 590 foot pounds of torque. That's all for now. Come back to AutoWeek.com all day for constantly updated Paris news and check out our related video section too. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Enjoy the drive. Catch all the latest auto enthusiast news at AutoWeek.com, in AutoWeek magazine and iPad edition. Talk with us on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter at AutoWeek USA.